Hello, this is Father Tim. I hope this finds you well and you're having a blessed week. As you know, we're in the season of stewardship at St. Mark's. Our goal this year is $1.1 million for 2024, and we need your help in keeping the light that is St. Mark's shining for all of us. We launched our efforts last week with a letter to all of you. We had a message from our stewardship chair at our 8 and 1030 services. And I want you to listen again to a part of that message. Listen to it, imagine, share it with others. Please think about how you can share what you can financially give to ensure St. Mark's is a beacon in the city, in the diocese of the Minnesota, and for generations to come. The pledge forms are on our website. May God bless and keep you. May you have a blessed week. Amen. So I want this place to thrive. It needs to thrive. But like most all churches, and especially inner city places of worship like St. Mark's, the last few years have been difficult financially. The pandemic, which seems so far away so long ago, cut deeply into our finances. Plate income virtually vanished as there were no services. People found themselves out of work, and as a result, the pledge income rightfully diminished, as it was hard for everyone. Now, most of my career has been in fundraising, so let's talk about that for a minute. Simply put, we need about 1.1 million in 2024 to help the cathedral maintain and expand its mission. That includes little things like keeping the lights on and the heat on, but more important things actually than like the live stream broadcast <clears throat> and the programs that we have for the children and the adults and for the community we serve outside. Now I'll admit 1.1 million sounds like a lot, but we will pledge as a group, as a congregation, 950,000 in 2023. So it's a doable goal, we can do this. So I'm asking you to do this. Listen to what you hear in this place. Listen to the music, listen to the message. Look around you as you sit here to who else is here and needs us and to think about the community around us who needs us as well and imagine what's possible. What you can do, what we all can do collectively for this place. Finally, discern what of your own treasure you can share to make this place the vibrant oasis that you want it to be what other people need it to be, and most of all, what God wants it to be. This is a place of community of and for the people who are ready and willing to help change our community, change our world, and make St. Mark's a place of hope and light for everyone for a, <clears throat> for a very long time to come. Now, you all have commitment cards that you were handed, I think, by the ushers this morning. You all received a letter over the week, last week, Friday, from myself and the senior warden. I'll ask you this again. Listen to the need. Imagine how you can sh make a difference and share your treasure to make St. Mark's a beacon, not only for you, but for generations to follow. We need your help. May God bless you. Thanks very much.